Well, they're definitely spraying west of the Gila Forest. I've noticed in my last few years of camping in the Gila Forest that I never see chemtrails or geoengineering. And I always wondered why that was. Everybody else was getting it, but in the summers, I never got it in the Gila Forest. In fact, I never got it in any federal area that I have been on. But I know others have. So I wondered about that, and I took it upon myself this year to do something completely different and go west of the Gila Mountains. What goes on west of the Gila in Arizona? And that's where I am. I'm in Arizona. And the Gila is right over there. Good morning, Miss Mika. So, maybe things have changed this year because it looks like it's drifting in to the Gila Mountains. Unless something happens with the elevation, maybe? I don't think so. It's blowing in there. And that stuff will be blowing directly into the Gila. I should have did a time lapse. This is an hour later. It's all kind of dispersed now. There must be a base like in Phoenix, because when I was watching the lines in Truth or Consequences, New Mexico, all the different angles all kind of poke towards Phoenix area. Now, where I am, I see there's lines that way, but it seems like the whole sky is that way. Those are going a different direction over there. Those are going like that. I don't know if that's from that same. Looks like everything's pointing towards there, though. That's going there, and those are going there. So I'm getting closer to the base. On my GPS maps, that's Phoenix. And that was Tucson. So I'm thinking they're originating just north of Tucson. As you get closer, it gets easier, but it gets harder. Kind of strange.